myself R Amuda, Assistant Professor, Department of Information Technology from Hindustan College of Engineering and Technology. Today we are going to discuss about the topic Introduction to Internet and Web Technology. Internet is a global network that contains many interconnected autonomous networks and web technology refers to various tools and techniques that are utilized in the process of communication between different types of devices over the internet. Today we are going to discuss about the various topics related to web essentials and the various web technologies. Now let us discuss various essentials that are required to access the information through the internet. The first one is server. A server is a device that is used to provide service to another computer and its user. So the user is called as the client. The system that provides the information to client is called the server. And the second one is client. So client is a software that will reside on the remote machine. So it will communicate with the server and get the information, process it and displays onto the remote machine. And third essential thing is the protocol. Protocol is a set of rules which is used by the computer to communicate each other across the internet. The next web essential is the internet. The internet is called a network of network and it is the network which allows to exchange the data between two or more computers and it uses the protocol TCP IP. And the next one is the web page. Web page means it is a document, it contains information. And the website means it is a collection of web pages. So these collection of web pages are called the website. The next uh, web essential is the web server. Uh, the web server is a software and a hardware and it uses the hypertext uh, transfer protocol and it is used to provide a response to the client request. And uh, the next one is the web browser. Browser is a a software and the browser will send uh, the request to the server by using the uh, message HTTP request. The various example for the browser are uh, Microsoft Internet Explorer and uh, Google Chrome, Mozilla Firefox and a lot of browser are there. And the next term related to the web essential is the www that is World Wide Web. It is commonly called as a web. It is used to interlink all the uh, hypertext uh, documents which can be accessed through the internet. The next uh, web essential is uh, HTTP. The full form is Hypertext Transfer Protocol. It was developed by Tim Berners-Lee in the year 1991. So it is used to, to provide communication between the server and the client. So it will transfer the pages between the client and the server. And the next uh, web essential is the URI. URI, the full form is Uniform Resource Identifier. So this identifier is used to identify the object over the internet. So to identify the object in the internet, we can use URL and URN. So URL means Uniform Resource Locator and URN is Uniform Resource Name. The next web essential is client-server communication. Whenever the client wants to access any information over the internet, it just simply sends the request to the server. The server will be mostly listening to the network and it will process the request and send the corresponding page to the client. Now we are going to discuss about HTML. HTML stands for Hypertext Markup Language. So it is one of the technology that's used to, uh, to display the document in the uh, browser. Actually, HTML was developed by Tim Berners-Lee in the year 1989. It is a markup language 
and it is used to link the web pages so it is the so the name is hypertext so as the name suggests it is a markup language so it is used to uh, mark up the text using the tag how to display the uh, contents in the web page html is used to create the web page and it contains uh, both the simple uh, text as well as it contains uh, complex uh, multimedia objects the multimedia objects can be sound images videos and the app letter uh, the tag we are using different uh, tags in the html document so these tags are used to, to describe uh, uh, how the uh, web page uh, should be uh, displayed and um, html document contains uh, tags as well as the plain text the html document is also called as the web pages now we can discuss about the html tags usually the tags are called keywords and it is uh, surrounded by angle brackets the tags will uh, normally comes in the pair and it looks like in the with this inside the angle bracket and the first tag is called the start tag and the second tag is called the end tag the end tag will be uh, always seen with the slash in the html tag the start and the end tags are called the opening tag and the closing tag see this is the syntax for the for writing the tag so inside the angle bracket we have to write the tag name and this is uh, the opening tag and the closing tag there are two types of tag pair tag and the singular tag so pair tag will always comes with the both start tag and the end tag in the single tag it will have only the starting tag but there is no ending tag so in this example title uh, so this title represent the pair tag so in between this uh, tag title there is a content the content is a this is document title uh, this diagram represent the structure of html here the html is the root tag and uh, for this root tag h head and the body or the child tag inside the head tag only you have to write the title tag so in the structure the first line represent the document type html this uh, uh, shows the version and type of the html and html is the root tag inside the html uh, tag we have to write the head tag and inside the head tag we have to write the title okay till this we have discussed about the uh, web essentials and the technology that was used over the web thank you